that makes me think of the the superhero power that I always thought would be a good one to have is to be able to like rewind your life like five minutes. Oh, like you press a button, it would run. Cool. So you could just slap that guy on the side of the head super hard, <laughs> and then rewind five minutes and not do it, but you had the satisfaction of uh, seeing yep. what so it would have been. Like. Cool. Like erase that. consequences from your life. Yeah. yeah. I, did, I was going to shoot say, someone yeah. in the head and rewind or whatever. It's like, you can only go back five minutes. It didn't actually though. happen. Yeah. Okay. What if you did something terrible and you were like, um, you were just like basking in the glory of it and then you accidentally went too yeah. far that's forward? A, like, oh, no. That's five a minute, Rick one and second. Morty episode. Yeah, that's basically. That's bad. Yeah. Um, I always thought a cool superpower to have would be to just be able to stop time and start it again at will, but you be able to move freely yeah. while time is stopped. Like sure. So I would go to a oh, shopping man. mall. I go to a shopping mall and I would fucking I would stop time. I'd pull everybody's pants down and then I'd go off Classic. somewhere where I could watch and then I'd start time again and watch all the whole confusion. Everybody, what the fuck? Where's my ass out? You know, it was hilarious, <laughs> dude. It's a type of power that would corrupt. I'm sure. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, okay, yeah. what about what about let's let's keep going on this. What about Tim? What, what kind of superpower would you like to have? Uh, well, I believe in a different uh, version of the podcast <laughs> at the live in the studio we all agree that never having to poop again would never be great shitting again yeah, yeah, yeah pooping's a minor inconvenience no, no more it? bodily functions yeah it's zero function just not having don't to, breathe, have to breathe anymore. don't have to eat no poop no pee dude you could go anywhere in space if you didn't yeah it'd be great just drift else. around in yeah. outer space probably be pretty cold though hey whatever yeah. doesn't matter to you you're We're canadians yeah be okay <laughs> just bring a fucking toque you'll be all right <laughs> bad yeah, you'll get used to it Jono, what super ha- power would you... Think of how much money you would save if you didn't have to eat. Yeah, no shit, true. dude. I and mean, time. The, the five minute in reverse thing is pretty appealing. It's pretty cool. It's great, yeah. right? Because then you cool. could just test out things and you're like, eh. But you couldn't test out long term effects of things. Mm. What if like killing somebody turned out to be really good for you in your life somehow? Yeah. And then, you know, the first five minutes were terrible, but, you know, the 10th minute was great. <laughs> <laughs> you won the lottery 10 minutes later because you killed that guy? No, if I can do that, I'd do flight. That one always appealed to me. Yeah. It's flying so around. impractical, but I don't know. Just like, I think it'd be awesome. Oh, I don't feel like taking the stairs today. Just but it'd floating. be so cold out. Yeah. Yeah. If you're flying around. Wear a jacket. Yeah, we're yeah. Canadians, remember? <laughs> Going skydiving, though, bite. like, you have to wear, like... A ton of clothes and like windbreakers and stuff, and it's still cold as fuck. Nah, I'd go it naked. I think that's the the power move is fly around everywhere <laughs> naked. With your think about that. Okay, everywhere. so one time <laughs> flying squirrel, we drove somewhere, and the the tarp on the back of the vehicle we were driving was flapping in the wind. Yeah. And by the end of that trip, that thing was shredded. Yeah. So like, think about <laughs> oh, what would happen? You'd have to tape naked. it. You'd have to hey, tape listen, it to your leg. Think dude. about your pecker, bro. Dude, free yeah. vasectomy. That thing would get <laughs> obliterated. <laughs> For Any man can go out and have his balls smashed with a hammer by a doctor. <laughs> In Canada, oh, have did. you guys seen that movie Midsummer? Yes. No. You know I did. The, the part with the mallet? The guy gets hit with the mallet? I don't remember that part. I just remember the he, jumping off the cliff Yeah, yeah. Part. It was like after they jump off the cliff, yeah. and then the guy's still alive, so they oh, bring out this like that's... comic book style mallet and smash his head, and I just imagine that's very similar to getting a vasectomy. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> Not at all. They use an axe instead. <laughs> yeah. Just a rusty like a, old hatchet. A golf club oh. and a, the golf tee. Uh, baseball bat. <laughs> oh, the tee. <laughs> just blast. 